टूडे वी विल डू द लार्वल फॉर्म्स ऑफ इकाइनोडर मेट्स लार्वल फॉर्म्स ऑफ इकाइनो डरमेट्स इन चैप्टर स्टार फिश वो आई हैव टोल्ड यू कि दिस लार्वल फॉर्म्स दे आर वेरी मच इंपॉर्टेंट इन केस ऑफ इन केस ऑफ evolutionary point of view this is understood ki oschavi mein bar bar the sci in evolutionary point of view nal they larva they are very much important as compared to other chapters so this is the indirect type of metamorphosis ya indirect of development this is called where the important larvas they are formed that is called the indirect development clear direct ki hundi hai jado larva jada ve koi is tarah de banan which is not different from adult theek hai that is called the direct development now it is indirect development in all the classes of the echino dermates और ईच लार्वा दैट हैज इट्स ईच लार्वा ऑफ ईच क्लास दैट इज इंपॉर्टेंट एंड हैज इट्स ओन वैल्यू और टुमारो इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर आई हैव टोल्ड यू कि दिस डायप्लूरा लार्वा दिस इज बेसिक लार्वा फॉर ऑल द फर्दर larvas are all further larva means of other classes also ode vich kinniyan sariyan jis tarah echinoder echinoder mates de andar ophthyria uh, antidon specimens we have studied padhe hai na pa antidon echinus unna sariyan de larve jehde hai that is base of this डाइपलूरा लार्वा डाइपलूरा लार्वा दिस इज बेसिक लार्वा विच इज फर्दर मॉडिफिकेशन ऑफ अदर क्लासिस ऑफ दिस इकाइनोडर मेट्स दे है बेसिक लार्वा इज लाइक दिस एंड लाइक दिस दिस इज अगेन ए बाइपनेरिया डाइपनेरिया लार्वा clear why it is called a dipneria in previous lecture also i told you there are present two bands the total uh, cilia from the outer body that is confined to this uh, region band like region which is called the this is called the lateral lobes this is pre oral pre oral loop pre oral loop clear this is the base of this total ring like structure which is present around the mouth what is this what is this ring like structure or uh, rectangular structure this is made up of cilia which help in the movement from one place to another place for what they move they move from one place to another for the food for the shelter roti kapda aur makan chahiye na for that they need the for the food they need this movement that is by this what they are called this is the pre oral loop which is above the mouth why it is called pre oral because it is above the mouth or these sides they are called the lateral ones theek hai clear hai gal 
ਔਰ ਇਹ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਵੈ ਹਰ ਇੱਕ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਬੇਸਿਕ ਲਾਰਵਾ ਵੈ ਇਹਦੇ ਤੋਂ ਹੀ ਜਿਹੜੀਆਂ ਫਰਦਰ ਡਿਵੈਲਪਮੈਂਟ ਹੋਣੀ ਹੈ ਉਹ ਕਿਦੇ ਤੋਂ ਹੋਣੀ ਹੈ ਡਾਈਪਲੇਰੀਆ ਲਾਰਵਾ ਨੈਕਸਟ ਇਸ ਇਟਸ ਨੇਮ ਇਸ ਬਾਈਪਨੇਰੀਆ ਲਾਰਵਾ ਨੈਕਸਟ ਇਸ ਥਿਸ ਲਾਰਵਾ ਥਿਸ ਲਾਰਵਾ देयर इज फॉर्मेशन ऑफ दिस दिस इज माउथ दिस इज कॉल्ड द प्री ओरल लोब प्री ओरल लोब और अराउंड दैट दिस वन around this this become like uh, this further development is takes place which is called pre oral loop this is lobe that is a loop above the mouth next is next larva that is this larva that is called the bipinaria larva now it is called the bipinaria larva here is in the bipinaria larva here you can see this this loop or this lobe they are further developed or expanded from mouth to the lateral side this is confined this one pre oral loop understand now this pre oral loop is confined only to the mouth portion dekho kalla hi mouth de wale do wale hai na clear hai second one which is lobe like that is start from the upper end from the mouth region and expanded to the lower region also that is expanded toward the lower region also means they encircled the mouth as well as lower portion also from like intestine anus stomach that moving toward the that side now it has again two three parts this is pre oral loop in the center there is present alimentary canal a alimentary canal kide to bani hai this is formed from endoderm na us lecture ch vi dassya si this is formed from endoderm or avla portion jada which is formed from ectoderm ectoderm theek hai jehde ectoderm te cilia si now they are present in band like structure around the mouth जिन्ने भी एक्टोडर्म दे ऊपर सिलिया सी ओ सारे किथे आ गए दैट इज कंफाइंड टू द दिस पोर्शन ओनली केड़े वाला अराउंड द माउथ एंड फॉर्म ए बैंड लाइक स्ट्रक्चर्स और इट्स फंक्शन इज टू द मूवमेंट फ्रॉम वन प्लेस टू अनदर प्लेस फॉर द सर्च ऑफ द फूड क्लियर बिकॉज़ दे हैव माउथ दे कैन फीड नेक्स्ट there is expansion this is from upper side this is toward the lower side or what are these these are the lateral loops o pre oral ban gaye aur a dono ki ban gaya lateral loop now this lateral loop also have further divided into many parts see here it is expanded on upper side as well as on the lower side you can see it is toward encircling the part of stomach as well as intestine now let's see this is pre oral loop likhte bhi hai bolo pre oral loop aur enu asi ki likhange median dorsal arm median dorsal arm then is next is avali anterior dorsal arm anterior side te hai te dorsal side dorsal agli wali hogi anterior dorsal side 
this is towards the posterior side this is called posterior dorsal arm jehdi agle passe hoegi onnu ki kahange anterior dorsal jehdi pichle passe hoegi onnu ki kahange anterior uh, anterior ya posterior ventral arm clear un edich next further it is more advanced this is called bipinaria larva what it is called bipinaria larva advanced and developed this is median dorsal lobe evely clear eh? it starts from here and expanded here and further developed here this is called median dorsal arm next is this one anterior dorsal arm we have written anterior dorsal arm that is moving toward the anterior side but it is difficult eh? comparatively so confined to these chapter this chapter or these diagram a dekho a agi anterior dorsal arm there is development of the anterior dorsal arm there is posterior dorsal arm there is posterior dorsal arm or these two are the posterior arms or you can say them the lateral arms clear eh? this is the development of this outer loop in the center way in the central what that that is also divided into three arms because this is above the mouth only this is above the mouth so it is called the pre oral arm clear pre oral this is called the pre oral arm this is bipinaria larva of asteroidia s class asteroidia और केड़ी एग्जांपल ओदे च केड़ी आ जानी है स्टारफिश स्टार फिश एनु हुन पॉज इन प्रीवियस अर्लियर और प्रीवियस पार्ट आई टोल्ड यू द लार्वा डाइपनेरिया लार्वा ਇਹਨੂੰ ਇਹਨੂੰ ਕਰੀ ਡਿਲੀਟ ਇਨ ਮੇਕ ਪਾਰਟ ਨੂੰ ਐਸ ਆ ਆਈ ਹੈਵ ਵਿਲ ਟੋਲਡ ਯੂ ਕਿ ਬਾਈਪਨੇਰੀਆ ਲਾਰਵਾ ਦੈਟ ਇਜ਼ ਅ ਡਾਈਪਲੂਰਲ ਲਾਰਵਾ ਦੈਟ ਇਜ਼ ਦਾ ਬੇਸਿਕ ਲਾਰਵਾ ਵਿਚ ਫਾਰਮਸ ਦਾ ਬਾਈਪਨੇਰੀਆ ਲਾਰਵਾ ਦੈਨ ਆਰਕਿਓਲੇਰੀਆ ਲਾਰਵਾ ਬ੍ਰੈਂਕਿਓ ਆਰਕਿਓਲੇਰੀਆ ਲਾਰਵਾ ਦੈਟ ਇਜ਼ ਦਾ ਆਰਕਿਓਲੇਰੀਆ ਲਾਰਵਾ मतलब जेड़ा डाइपनेरिया लार्वा बाइपनेरिया लार्वा दे आर द बेसिक वंस देन देयर इज फॉर्मेशन ऑफ नेक्स्ट इन सम केसेस देयर इज फॉर्मेशन ऑफ बाइपनेरिया लार्वा तो की बनिया ब्रेंकियोलेरिया लार्वा एंड आर्कियोलेरिया लार्वा और इन सम डोलियोलेरिया लार्वा ए सारे लार्वे जड़े है किदे तो बने डाइपलेरिया लार्वा तो बट आफ्टर दैट देयर इज बाइफरकेशन ट्राइफरकेशन और जिन्नियां भी क्लासेस है हर एक दे विच अलग-अलग लार्वे बनेंगे लाइक इन स्टारफिश केस देयर इज फॉर्मेशन ऑफ दिस ब्रेंकियोलेरिया larva branchiolaria larva theek hai here name indicate branchio means there should be some pedicellaries or some or parts which help in respiration here are the these three these are the arms jehdi aapa ode ch padhiyan si pre oral arms above the mouth then is these are the structures 
anterior dorsal arms which is toward the anterior side then is posterior dorsal arms that is toward the posterior side means niche side then is these are the posterior lateral arms means arms which is on the lower portion but they are on the sides means posterior ho gaya niche and on the sides clear situations and beside that there are present post oral arms the present here which is above the mouth pre oral here it is pre oral arms here it is below it and near the anus so it is called the post oral arm jedi mouth de niche hai that is called post oral i think these all arms are clear this is branchial larva why it is called branchial larva because there is present one two and three branchial branchial area arms clear क्यों इन कहने और दिस हेल्प इन रेस्पिरेशन ऑफ कोर्स दैट्स वाई दे गॉट द नंबर दीज आर दिलियरी बैंड पहला मैं दसिया ब्रेंक्योल एरिया लारवा च प्री ओरल बैंड दे आर मेड अप ऑफ सिलियस बट दीज थ्री स्ट्रक्चर दीज थ्री आर्म्स कड़िया वाली ब्रेंक्योल एरिया आर्म्स they are not made up of cilia these are the extensions from the outer body one is the middle and two are the laterals at the tip of each there is present which is sent in the center that is called median center dorsal arm which is toward the sides they are called the lateral ones or at the tip of each there is present sucker there is present sucker the function of sucker is fixes or attached to the sub stratum after this metamorphosis is takes place means this this bilateral symmetry change into radial symmetry after fixation from these suckers they change into horizontally first they are like this then they are expanded like this or that become the radial symmetry clear hai this is in the asteroidia class asteroidia aur kide vich starfish i think clear after bipinaria larva ya or dipleural larva padhya apna basic larva main dassya si always focus on kehde wale larva ch dipleural larva ch theek hai bipinaria larva ch after the bipinaria larva there is in another case that is ऑर्क्योलेरिया लार्वा कड़ा लार्वा ऑर्क्योलेरिया लार्वा देयर इज प्रेजेंट वन सिंगल रिंग लाइक सिलियास व्हिच हैज नंबर ऑफ पार्ट्स देयर इज नॉट अबव व्हिच इज ऑन द लेंट्रल साइड्स दैट इज कॉल्ड प्री ओरल लूप की कहने ओनु pre oral why it is called pre oral above the mouth above the mouth in that case they surround the mouth here they are on the lateral sides clear hai then on the lower side this is another avalia arms a gaya then is anal loop anal loop means which surrounds the anus that is called the anal loop 
or these are the lateral ones lateral arms kadiya waliya lateral posterior arms write down their name lateral posterior arms i think this is again clear arcuolaria larva the example of arcuolaria larva that is holothuroidea in class holothuroidea the member of holothuroidea is cucumeria cucumeria example of this is clear next larva that is this larva dorio dorio laria larva dorio laria larva this is present in another some class it is different very much different from the other classes very much different from other classes that larva is called this larva is dorio laria larva here they have five bands now see 1 2 3 4 and 5 band rows of bands kade bands hai of course cilias of course cilias band on the upper side here there are present sucker like structures here are present tuft of cilia tuft means group of long cilia which lead jidro jidro agge chalna hai this portion lead a these are called the apical sensory tuft clear then is there is also present just below that adhesive pit what is the mean or what is adhesive mean which is kya hoga chipke so the suckers which do that function which is fixes with the substratum with hair this ad adhesive pipped uh, pit they are attached with the sub stratum from here they attach the substratum there is vestibule basal ciliary rings deltoids different different structures of the various parts of the body so it is very much different from these two uh, uh, layer, uh, these two larva brancularia and arcuolaria larva because they don't have such arms which is expanded outside the body you can see here there is no expanded part outside this this is confined only to the these portion in the central portion at different places this is one tuft this is second this is third this is fourth and this is fifth clear next larva next larva another type of larva earlier we have done which larva brankio laria larva arcuolaria larva and then dolio laria larva fourth one is platyus larva this platyus larva they have mouth as esophagus stomach anus around this there is present this band of cilia they are divided into four portions upper one is pre oral and lower one is post oral now these sides arms they are called anterior lateral arms and this is which is below this there is present below the mouth or on the lower portion that is called posterior 
dorsal means they are on posterior side and uh, uh, dorsal side dorsal front side odate or except that there are hydrocel hydrocel means water which where the body cavity which contain the water right stomocele means near the stomach body cavity near the stomach this is the structure of platelets larva then is this larva that is echinoidea platelets larva that larva is present in bristle star bristle star this is present in this larva is present in the echinus echi nas jidiya koi bhi arms nahi gaya theek hai that is in the central portion and round now this larva that is again formed from diapleura larva or bipinaria larva they have total 1 2 3 4 5 5 such arms first this is the elementary canal in the center just above there are present two pre oral arms do gaya na then there is present around that anterior lateral arms according to agle passe hai plus they are on the lateral sides then is these are the post oral below the mouth so they are called the post oral arms clear hai kinni ho gaya tin tin pair 1 2 3 pairs Le left and right after that there is present posterior dorsal arms posterior side te agle passe dorsal side te posterior dorsal arms these are the arms present in them or this is the elementary canal mouth esophagus stomach then is anus intestine and there are also present posterior lateral processes which are hard in structure they contain the calcium rings clear there are present five pair of arms in case of echinoplatyu larva the difference is that is confined in the center or this is again out side also like arcuolaria larva and branchiolaria larva clear hai this is this is the last one why these larvas are important these larvas are important because their body that has all you can see they have bilateral symmetry either adult has radial symmetry this is all together symmetry different from the adult one so these larvas or they are different from one another in another phylums also the formation of larva like in uh, in case of hemichordate their basic larva is very much similar with the larva of diapleura larva or diapleura larva so it is a gateway to enter into the that world of other larva so they are very much important bilateral symmetry change into radial symmetry thank you very much any questions